after she was found with a fractured jaw and broken leg. News 18's Marvin Bills introduces us to Amelia and the two Lafayette women who traveled across the country to save her. She just she looked so defeated and um, I just knew that you know it was critical. Found underneath a home in Louisiana, five month old Amelia was left to die. So they think she was probably hit by a car. So her right leg was broken. Her right front leg is lame. Janice Indretz came across a shared post on Facebook about Amelia. Rescuers found her whimpering for help. Janice stepped in. The shelter down there said they would not release her to um, Christy and me until they had a rescue commitment. Christy is a friend of Janice. She wanted to help a man's best friend. We started talking. Uh, and uh, coming up with the idea. The idea to rescue Amelia, who was suffering from a broken jaw and multiple broken bones. I called down there and she said, uh, she says, well, she has a lot of injury and they will probably go ahead and euthanize her. The lady started working on ways to rescue little Amelia, but the cost was stepping in the way. The LSU bill was $4,500 and, you know, I don't, I don't have that. <laughs> Without giving up, a GoFundMe page was created and strides were made to rescue little Amelia. It was music to Janice's ears that little Amelia was able to be rescued. I had to pull over because um, I started crying. <laughs> and I called Christy and I said, they've got her. And after traveling 14 hours, Christy and Janice were finally able to meet Amelia. Left to die and almost euthanized, she's a Hoosier now. Oh my goodness, she's so tiny. <laughs> In Dayton, Marvin Bills, News 18. Thank you so much, Marvin. Janice has also rescued an animal from Romania. Amelia will continue to receive aftercare at Purdue University Small Animal Hospital. Well, we'll have more News 18 at 6 when we come back after the break. Stay with us.